Hey everybody, this is Heather Clark with Running Totally Free and good morning. <laughs> I'm looking pretty poopy. Um, yeah, we, uh, I figured if I didn't, oh hi buddy. Look, this is, this is Gabe saying good morning. Say hi everyone. Can you wave? Say hi. There's people in there. There's people in that camera. Say good morning. Where's your wave? He tried. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. Can't touch the buttons. He's going to sit and drink his bottle. Yeah. Say hi, buddy. That's my cave. So he's sitting drinking his milk, and there's Noah also trying to wake yeah. up. <laughs> and I'm trying to wake up. See my beautiful, wavy, uh, fluffy, <laughs> hair. fluffy hair. I love how um, the encouraging homeschooling mom says she calls it her Mufasa hair. <laughs> I think I have Mufasa hair too uh, in the morning. So right now I'm in the, this is my coffee area my little coffee bar protein bar um, this is from Michael's protein shakes anyway um, I feel like I'm not gonna be able to talk to you if I don't talk to you now because we have been um, crazy busy because this weekend on Saturday we had a garage sale so on Friday the, uh, Noah mostly and Abby, Abby was helpful because she took care of Gabe um, and Noah helped me uh, get everything ready with the stuff that we sold at the garage sale. And um, so we had a garage sale on Saturday and did very well. And um, we uh, bought, were, were, what I want to say, I think I told you guys that Gabe is now writing on himself. <laughs> <laughs> with markers it's official I told you he was getting into the writing utensils like um, eating erasers uh, from our um, what do you call them um, what are they called? the pencils that you guys know um, you know the pencils you don't have to sharpen this is this is called morning brain um, I was the erasers on the ends. Yeah. And, um, on so he's just started writing on himself with marker. So we found him with a purple stripe on the side of his head, like a racing stripe all weekend. <laughs> so this is not going to get better because he's 16 months old. It's only getting worse, going to get worse from here. So, uh, yeah. Um, so those things have to get hidden and apparently Ikea has some has a filing cabinet that looks very similar um, in color to those over there so we're gonna look for that and then um, uh, you I know you guys have seen this so you have to have seen these they're really really popular and they're on my phone I think I have a picture I wanted to show you um, in what we call the playroom, um, it's just gotten to the point where Gabe, Gabe and Noah share a room, and right now that room is dangerous because Noah, um, rightfully so, should be able to share, be able to save his um, his Legos, but obviously that's dangerous for Gabe right now. Yes, so let me get these really close. I want to buy two sets of these for the playroom downstairs um, for all of Gabe's toys, which aren't that many. It's just that they're kind of awkward and huge. You kind of know, I'm sure you know how toddlers toys are. So that was basically what the um, garage sale was about because, you know, we don't have a cash envelope for Gabe's toys to keep him safe or, you know, furniture to keep Gabe safe. That was not a part of the equation. So, this is what we're doing to not go into debt. You know, this is this is the strategy. <laughs> so um, my good friend Andrea is very kindly mm, taking us to IKEA. She has two kids that are like around Noah and Abby's age. Yeah, I'm sure you just heard that. Um, and so we're all going up to IKEA in Atlanta together. 
And then I told her, oh, let's do that in, uh, in exchange for um, food at Michael's restaurant. So uh, we're going to feed them. <laughs> <laughs> and she is going to drive us up there, and we're going to um, have a good time. You know, guys, if you've been to Ikea before, it's a lot of fun to hang out there and see all the fun, you know, goodies there, um, the cool stuff, you know, like the way they set up the rooms and, uh, you know, all just the neat little gadgets. And I don't know. I just think it's cool, and it's, it, it's, it's inspirational for things that you can do organizationally. Um, yeah, so that's today. Uh, so Sunday, uh, what do I want to say? So, uh, like all day on, it was so hot on Saturday. It was awful. I mean, I really thought I was going to faint. I had Noah bring out salt pills for me because it was that hot, um, in Georgia that day. Um, but we did very well. And a lot of it was that people kept texting me, um, or messaging me from our buy, sell trade. And that worked out great. So I was very, very grateful for that. And then Sunday we went um, to Lake Lanier to have some good family time. We really needed that. And um, we usually go to church. We're churchgoers, um, but we're having a hard time finding a church that we're real happy with right now. And we have those season passes, which we're so happy for. You know, to have, and it's only going to be like a couple more weeks if that's open. So we figured we'll just go with that for a little while. So, um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. So, anyway, the kids and I did do a little dumpster diving, and uh, we found we went to Bath and Body Works, and there were guys there. Um, there was a delivery guy, so we kept waiting, 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 waiting. Finally, I'm like, you know what? Forget it. I'm going up to the stinking dumpster. There wasn't much to be found, but um, I wanted more of these um, for around the house because I'm believing we do have more of the, the things that fill these. Uh, I found that one of them that I that I had was broken, so I couldn't use it. Um, so I wanted more of these, and I found them. So I've got one, two, three, four, and there's one in the garage that Gabe grabbed out of the bag and just played with. He didn't stick it in a socket, I promise. He just took it out and put it on the garage floor. Then we found, I'll just show these to you. We found um, those containers at Dollar Tree. And we also found, and I really, really this is so disgusting. It just feels disgusting. It feels kind of like the soup. Um, there's a bottle of White Rain uh, Moisturizing Body Wash. And then there's a bottle of Palm Olive that is so, like, I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be salvageable now. It's just leaking like crazy and then we found two of these drink cups um i don't think they're correct and we found once again this is so funny we keep finding these trash bags um i guess people keep popping them open or something i don't know but hey i'll take them um so it was a small find but we didn't have a lot of time and then the very exciting thing that i think we mentioned but didn't show you was we found a Bread machine! Yay! Now, I want to try, I really wanted to try this, and it's on our, you know, our schedule this week. It's something we're going to experiment with. It was seven, seven ninety seven at um, Goodwill, and we went through all, like, the different, I don't know what you call these, cycles. And so, and it looks really, it looks really in good condition. Not beat up at all. It looks like they didn't really use it, honestly. <laughs> So that's good for us. Um, uh, so really, really thrilled about that. Um, and so that's going to be kind of part of school is we'll be experimenting with cooking because, you know, cooking is a science. And definitely making bread is a science because if you mess up with, like, the temperature and the yeast and all of that, um, you can really mess up bread. Uh, yeah. Um, I am sorry for anybody who's been following with the Bible study. We've uh, on this end, the ladies. We've been having difficulty getting together. All uh, there, there's just been things coming up with people's jobs, and um, so we finally only two of us were able to get together last night, and we finished the Bible study. But I just. We, we stayed, we, we talked and stuff for a long time last night, and so I wasn't able to get a video in. 
so I want to do that. And um, I'm kind of up in the air as to if and what will be next. So um, that hasn't happened. But we did have a Bible study last night, and that was great. Um, also, I had to take Gabe to the doctor on Monday. That was the other thing that, whoops, that has kept me busy. Um, Gabe had to go on a nebulizer because he has had a wheezy, wheezy, wheezy cough that has sounded terrible. Sounded terrible. So he has been breathing through this at night um, for a little bit. Yeah. Um, whoops, I dropped it. Um, yeah, he has sounded terrible. So that was another event that has happened in the Clark family. Um, yeah, so life just keeps going on. Um, so I think I covered all the bases. That's what we've been up to, guys. And I'm hoping that, um, I'm just hoping life will start to get back in order. We had a good day of school yesterday. Uh, tried some of our new, um, our, you know, I told you we were um, uh, moving up in our grades. And we started our new programs yesterday. And I think the kids liked it. I know I certainly did what we're trying. Um, the Institute for Excellence in Writing and um, the Spelling Zoo. And um, so I'm a happy camper as a teacher, a teacher slash mom in that regard. Yeah. So thank you for, for hanging in there with us, uh, listening to what we're doing here in the Clark household, our little bit of dumpster diving and our goodwill find. And um, we'll be back. And hopefully we will have done a you, another you uh, dumpster dive. Um, I'm not going to have a car for a couple days here because the way things worked with Michael's schedule, he's leaving really, really early in the morning and um, not coming home till late. That's just the, how things worked out. So I still got to get a grocery, um, figure out when I'm going grocery shopping and, so, and that um, kind of thing. So, uh, yeah. So uh, we'll see. So. Uh, thank you for all your support. Uh, if you like our channel, if you're new to our channel, please subscribe and hang with us. We are just a normal American family trying to make ends meet. We are really, really trying. And uh, so that's what we talk about. That's what you'll, that's what you'll, um, uh, I guess, watch. And uh, that's about it, guys. Uh, have a great day, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.